happening everybody welcome to get swamped i'm robbie there's z dog and there's scooter well we're off on another adventure and who knows where this one will take us you guys will just have to stick around check out the video and find out for yourselves the fun just never stops Whew. it's kind of cold it's only like 52 degrees so far today and it's too early hopefully it warms up and that sun comes out because it's frigid all right well we'll see you guys in a little, a little while hey guys what's happening we're once again, back on the road, and we are headed across the state of Florida to the other coast. He woke up. He did. He'll be asleep in no time. <laughs> he was already but, asleep. Nah, he was just resting his, his head eyes. Was back like this. Trying to. He was trying to, and then he said, "Oh, the camera's on." He heard your voice. Thank you. Yep. He said the camera's on. Uh, <laughs> I better wake up. Now he's trying to hide behind you. I know, I see that. <laughs> Thinks he can hide in the shadows. Oh, hopefully today warms up a little bit so I can take this sweatshirt off because it's just, I'm tired of wearing hoodies and sweatshirts and long johns and being cold. All right, well, it's top secret. I'm not gonna tell you where we're going. But if you guys want, jump in the back of the truck and you can come along with us. But I'm warning you, put on some warm coats and bundle up because it's kind of chilly out there. We can maybe fit two more people in the back here. Well, actually only one because there's coolers yep. behind me. So I don't know who the lucky one is going to be, but you guys Rochambeau over it. If you two fall asleep, I'm filming it. <laughs> if both of you fall asleep, I'm filming. Oh, we'll both wake up. You'll have to I'm film. I'm going to get nice close-ups of these guys. You'll have to, you'll have to film drool and hanging not out. That's what I'll do. Because the minute you say something, we're both going to snap away. Like... I just won't talk. <laughs> so now you're too scared to go to sleep. I'm awake now. <laughs> You're all awake. That means you too, Z. He's like, yeah, right. <laughs> I'll sleep through anything. Yes, he will. All right. I hope you guys enjoy the ride. Let's go. Seeing the water. 
Kennedy Space Center, half a mile. You got half of your face. Too bad there's not a space shuttle. There we go. I mean, there is a boat wash to shore. I know, that's from the hurricanes. Stuff around here. Exit yes. right to exit 49, State Route 3 toward Merritt Island, Kennedy Space Center. Oh. Then use the right two lanes to keep right to North Thursday Parkway. Oh, we're going to the Space Center? Yeah. Use the right two lanes oh, to man. keep right. Then use either we're going lane to Merritt to Island North first. I gotta go meet with my accountant. Yep. And then who knows what we'll use get into. Use either lane to turn right on North Curtinay Parkway. But it'll be fun. <laughs> Hopefully, we can get out to Josh's afterlife That'd park. Cool. He's over here. I gotta meet Josh because my accountant is his in father in law. Miles. Hmm. Turn right on West Merritt Talk Avenue. About keeping it in the family. Yep. Yep, definitely, brother, definitely. All right, here, I got a fun little game for you guys. Right now, rewind the video and count in the time lapse how many out of state license plates you see <laughs> on our drive up here. There's a little test for you. And that will be on the test, by the way. So let's see if you can get it right. further I think we're five minutes away so we'll see you guys in a little bit hi guys I got all my tax stuff my computer and everything this is Josh's father-in-law I guess what it's called right yeah, I think so yeah that's his wife's dad I said, you're going to love this guy. Yep. Hello? What's up, What's up brother? How are you? Awesome. So what the? My, this is my father-in-law's office. Dude. He's the biggest skull collector I know. Natural history items. Holy smokes. A little bit of everything. He's definitely got me beating skeletons and skulls and... Hey, I'm working on it. <laughs> Holy smokes, look at the baboon. Good boy. Z, look at this. This is incredible. You know what that is, Z? No, what? That's a camel toe. <laughs> Just the lobby, and he's got more. Oh my god, look at this! Another look at see, I told you, Yetis, Bigfoot, Swamp Apes. He's got them. That is wow! Oh my goodness! Holy rocks, minerals. He's doing the same stuff we are. Yep, anything you can imagine. Dude, this is incredible. So, I'm responsible for a bit of it, but I can't take credit for it all. I know a lot of your work's in here. Oh my goodness, dude. A polar bear, grizzly bear. There you go, a cave bear. That is super cool. That, oh my goodness, lion, tiger. Speaking of tigers, uh, you have mine done? Working on it. <laughs> working on it. <laughs> oh my goodness, look at this white rhino, black rhino. 
And I know this is all you. Oh. There's so many. So many. Oh my goodness. Look, Z. Mm. The rough lemurs. Look how long those canines are. The ringtail yeah. lemurs, flying lemur. Oh, collared lemur. That's amazing. Oh my goodness. This is absolutely incredible. This is unbelievable. All right. Well, is he here? He is. All right, let's, I'm, I'm going to do this. You can go show them. Let me put my yeah. laptop and stuff down there. I get, there, get this my is the taxes business area. done. Yeah. And do, oh my goodness. All right, guys, I got paperwork and stuff to do. Uh, Josh is going to go show Z and scoot around. But you got to see a little taste of this stuff. And then we're going to take off and go to Josh's house later. Get another taste. Man, traveling. Always fun with us. Right? Stick around. Have some fun. Oh, my goodness, Josh. Oh, babe, come back here. Check this out. Okay. So this room is one that uh, we're still trying to fill up, but... Yeah, quite a sense. bit of stuff. That makes sense. Got almost all the crocodilian collection in here. Wow. That's nice. Yeah, so there's an old antiqued taxidermy burial. Yeah, that thing's older than you. Yeah, a lot. 100 years probably. Older than me. Probably older than all three of us put together. Wow, God, there's some rare stuff in here. So we don't have room for, for everything full skeleton wise, but there's a kinkajou that I did for him. He's got a wallaby right here that. Mm -hmm. Wow. Oh, watch out, there's a snake here on the floor. Uh, uh, just a skeleton. Uh, God. I'm, I'm terrified of taking a step anywhere right now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we've got this cool cabinet too. Good. So this is all fluorescent minerals. Wow. Amazing. Oh wait, check it out with the light off. So we've got long wave and short wave through here. see how the different minerals react to the light. Yeah. There we go. It's crazy the different colors that appear. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the, the calcites light up real well. And then some of them even hold their color when you start to turn everything off. Yeah, there it is. You, wow. you did. Got a little bit of everything in here. Yep. I see that. <laughs> uh huh. This is his corner that we've got to put the fancy display cases in, and then he uh, hides all his kid giveaway stuff back here on the shelves. <laughs> so, fair he enough. Definitely really likes to teach, and yeah, fair he enough. likes to keep the kids involved. Yeah. So it's just the fish display right now? Yep, there's a few fish in there. So down here on the bottom, there's a couple gar. So those are found in Florida. Mm -hmm. Got an alligator gar and a long nose gar. Okay. What about this little guy? It's an isopod. So those are the roly polies of the sea. That's what cleans up all the dead carcasses on the bottom of the ocean. And a paddle fish. Paddle fish, yep. Yeah. So there's some 
half skeleton, half taxidermy fish. Got the fins still intact with all that. Got little Mata Mata turtle, articulated. Always smiling. <laughs> Big toad. Big toad. Speaking of smiling, look at the squirrel monkey. <laughs> The skull on it almost looks human. I know, it's kind of terrifying. Though, Isn't it? A it little is. bit? Yeah. Because it's got that nice round dome like a human would have. Yeah, exactly. Oh, the tiny skulls now. I am terrified of stepping on the thing oh, behind me. If you me. step back, I'll put my hand up. Okay, thank you. You uh. won't bite. Yeah, no, that's uh, that's the part that I'm not worried about. Just fall apart like dominoes? Yeah. You know the guys that can put it back together, though. Yes, we do. Yeah, but <laughs> again, I don't want to take that out of your time. <laughs> I wonder how many of these species you all have at the farm. Actually, quite Got a few. few. Yeah. Have that one there. Spectacle. Got that one. Dwarf. And Yakara, mm -hmm. we have uh, Cuban. Yeah. But I don't think. Do we have that dwarf? Uh, no. That's a different one. Yeah, I think we a... have the Schneider. Yeah. And then no salt water. We have the two on the bottom. Yeah. We got the one there. The Nile. Yeah. Yeah. We actually have two species of Nile because mm -hmm. you have uh, the East, East and, and West, West. African. Yeah. Crocodile. <laughs> Same species, but yeah. regional. Yeah. Broad. Yeah. Don't have those. No. Can't Eat find those. those. Yeah. Yes. The broad can... snout right there. Yep. Yeah, we have one of those. We had that too. Yeah. We're getting there. Yes. The more lets we have. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we have some of those too. Mm -hmm. We don't have, do we have black cayman? Uh, did. Did, that's right, yeah. we gotta get more. Yeah. We definitely don't have that. Don't look back yeah, there no. in the back corner. No. Somebody, somebody got carried away with their uh, expertise. Mm, I wonder, I wonder <laughs> who. <laughs> gotta keep the articulations fun. I think that's what your, that's your signature to all the. It is. <laughs> thing, yeah. That is cool. Watch it. No, okay, I might get you. We'll get you first. Oh no. Yeah, you will. Put, you already put your finger near it. Oh. That's just amazing. The teeth. Yeah. Yeah, it cleans them up. Oh, snakes. Yes. Well, not all the snakes. No. It'll be boring if that, was, if that was all the snakes. Has quite a few uh, interesting ones. Yeah. <laughs> There's so much more. I, I know, every time you, see, you, just, yeah. you just span just I a know. little bit, you see something you didn't see I before. I believe he's got almost 900 species of skulls in, on hand. Wow. I'm so sorry. He, loan, he loans them out to museums, zoos. I'd have to say that's probably close to what, or if not more, than what some museums have. Yeah. Huh? Sorry, my left leg gave out there for a second. Did it fall asleep on you from the ride? No, just from the, the amount. Ah. Uh, oh, having nine, over 900? Yeah. That's a lot of skulls. Yeah. Just nice. Monocle goes up. Yeah, it shows that. What's with the knife? <laughs> yeah, bone knife. So that's the lower jaw to an alligator. So it kind of got a little disintegrated in the cleaning process. So figured why not make it into something cool. That is actually yeah. pretty cool. Yeah, makes sense. Did you happen to make a sheet to go with it? I did not, but I've got uh, some snakeskin lying around. I might be able to figure out something. There you go. 
or even some uh, gator skin or croc skin. I can do it. it. I can do it. I mean, considering if it is alligator, then oh. do an alligator skin sheet. Thanks for another project I gotta figure out. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> This is really cool. Yeah, you all come back and not even know that you saw half the stuff before. Well, I was new again. Oh, yeah, sure. I know. Just seeing what he has here now. It's just like, well. That's cool. Josh's uh, father-in-law is really cool. He understands the whole YouTube thing, so he know, he's got a grasp on how to do my taxes because he's done them for other YouTubers. Um, awesome, awesome, awesome. I gotta get him a bunch, have Heather work on a bunch of stuff tomorrow while we're at the market. And we are now on our way to Josh's place. So this will be exciting. And Josh actually got a bunch of uh, stuff to donate to us for the auctions. Yep. And it's going to be really, really cool. He said, I hope you can use uh, a bunch of the... Uh, dyed agates. I said, of course. Of course, I'm almost out, dude. And he goes, these are real pretty ones. These are higher end ones than you had before. And I said, alright, cool. And he said he's got a, some Skull Z and some other stuff. So, did you guys enjoy checking out that collection? Yeah, it was Joy is an understatement. It was pretty amazing. Yeah. It was. He had some amazing stuff. Elephant skull right as you walk in. A mm -hmm. giraffe. And so many other cool, cool things. I loved his uh, Yeti collection. Yes. Yetis from all over. All over the world. It's pretty neat. Pretty, pretty, pretty neat. What you guys think of it, man? Neat stuff. He's got a lot, a lot of stuff. Yes, Josh did. did a lot of stuff for him. Yes. And he was actually into rocks and crystals, too. Yeah, I know. But, dude, his rock and crystal collection is unbelievable. It's all high, high dollar stuff. I mean, shoot, meteors he was showing us. He showed us a couple different meteors. And one of them, it was like 15 pounds and it's only this I think you held it yeah, too. Yeah, I held that one. That it was tiny as can be and then he showed us another one that was close to the same size and almost weighed nothing. Yeah. Yeah, it's definitely he does a lot of the same stuff we do except for he doesn't do the tribal. Yeah. Yeah. Stuff like we do different tribes. And, mm -hmm. But it was it was quite amazing, quite fascinating. And then his UV collection Yep, that was super, super cool. And then he actually gave us a new UV light, see? Yeah. That was cool. Yeah. He's hiding it back because he's trying to keep it see himself. It? Literally, he's hiding it. <laughs> no, he no, just put it somewhere it wouldn't get broken. He put it somewhere he can he can't reach. No, I put it so that no one touches the button. Ah, okay. That's a cool one. Who did he say it was made by? Super cool. Super cool. Or way too cool. That's what it was. That's a nice, that's like our other one almost. Yeah. But this one's got the filter on it, so it's uh -huh. a different UV. There's one, two, and three. Yep three different styles of UV. Three different, uh, what 
is it called, Z? Waves. Waves. UV waves. Yeah. Three different UV waves. So that's that's really, really neat. Now, we're just following Josh. And to his place. Go see all that. Turn left. Then make a U-turn. No. Use the left lane to make a U-turn. I'm not then making a U-turn. Then turn left on Cheney Highway. You shush. You shush. <laughs> you no tell me you turn. I'm following Josh. All right. But she says you're going the wrong way. She's wrong. <laughs> oh, Josh is doing a pit stop. Uh, we are making a pit stop right there. I see the sign. It says Popeyes. I don't see nothing. I'm blind right now. Here, if I UV react your light. No, do eyes. not do that. Then I will be blind. <laughs> hey, light's green, buddy. It's funny you can't see that it's on in the camera. Yeah, you can. You can see a, the I can see it. Whoop, whoop. That's a nice light. Use the left lane to keep left. Then make a U-turn. We don't right. want to make a U-turn yet. We don't. We're going to Popeyes. Make a U-turn on Cheney Highway. All right, guys. Pit stop, Popeyes, and then on to Josh's house. You guys, wait for me. Oh. oh. What? What? Hold on. I smell skunk. Yep. for our YouTube channel. It's good. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh. They have blueberry. I don't know. Hmm. All right, we'll have to wait and see what we get. Okay. Let's do this. Oh yeah, oh yeah. There we go. Mm -hmm. Spicy chicken sandwich. Yes. The choice, the fries, and well, just, you and, and you. Yeah, they went uh, classic. The they 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 went to the weak side. Yeah. <laughs> and <laughs> well, the fries are good though. They're spicy. Here, have a bite. Nope. Ooh, watch the fingers, man. Mmm. That's some good stuff, man. You guys ever get a chance to eat Popeyes? Get the chicken sandwich. Spicy. Spicy style. Really good. Maybe you can handle it. <laughs> if you can't, it's understandable. I, I don't know about you, but I got to eat, mm -hmm. and we got to get back on the road. So, oh, 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 yummy. All right, so we're hanging out at Josh's. He's showing us what the process is. This is a well-started, obviously, you can see there's a snake there. There's a gator. What is that, a coyote down there? Yep, a red fox still. Red fox? Yep, there's a few possum hands in there. And then you get them nice and wet, and they'll come get a drink. Look at all those beetles. That's what cleans the skeletons. So they eat all the connect connective tissue, so all these ribs will fall off, and that's what I'll rebuild bone by bone. Holy smokes. So you can see the fresh hatch down here. You can see all the teeny tiny beetles. Oh my goodness, look so at them. Those probably hatched out last night. What is this stuff? Those are cotton balls. That's just what they use for bedding. And once it gets too nasty and tore up, you switch out the colony. Wow. 
dude, you got cheap labor here. They oh. like literally work for food. They do. <laughs> Look at them all coming up. And they're like, he sprayed water quick. Let's go get a drink. So they, they eat better when it's fresh food, of course, but the fresh food smells and rots quicker. So you have to dry everything out before you give it to the bugs. Gotcha. That's amazing. Now, is there anything that can hurt the bugs? So if spiders can get into the bugs, they'll of course eat bugs. And then there are mites that if you keep the colonies too moist, can actually kill all the bugs. And then they're similar to like a head lice. Oh man. This is amazing though. So these are dermestid beetles. They are native to the United States. They're not some special import. You'll find them on the roadkill when the carcass is nice and dry after the flies and the maggots process their portion. Right. And Thank goodness you don't have to have a room filled with the maggots and the flies. Yeah. That is... What's the matter, Z? Huh? <laughs> the what? It smells. <laughs> After eating it, the smell gets me. <laughs> <laughs> Z's like about to throw up. Yeah. This is what I get to deal with every day. And I've got many, many colonies of beetles. That is insane. We would take you guys and show you inside, but there's trade secrets in there that Josh doesn't want to share and nor do I want to share them with everybody because Josh does his thing and he's got secrets. But we'll just show you the colony of beetles. You can see how many have come up now because he sprayed water in there. And they're in there doing their job. Wow. That is cool. We'll show you guys some finished product. You get to see a step there and we'll sh show you what he does. All right, go put it away, Josh. Z, you want to go in there with him? You going to help Josh? No. Well, we're going to leave you here for a week to help Josh. He's running to the truck. Just <laughs> you. He's got the keys. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I don't know. That is quite about. amazing. I don't smell anything. Please, I, it's starting to make me <laughs> queasy. Oh God, it might have the other seed. <laughs> All right, let's go check a, out a finished product, show these guys. All right, let's check out some of the things he does. Oh, this is cool. That's an Atlantic Stingray? Wow, that is amazing looking. And this is all cartilage, right? Yeah, that's all cartilage. So the beetles will actually eat that if I do not watch them. So you guys could have this to eat, but not this. <laughs> oh, trained beetles. <laughs> Monitored beetles. Oh my goodness, look at that ball python. That is cool. So like you saw in the bug container, every rib is glued on individually. That is super, super cool. And then, what's that? The, Jack Dempsey. That's a Jack Dempsey? Fish look cool, dude. They really, really do. That's amazing. So fish are by far the most difficult. Not just to clean are they? and whiten, but to articulate. So some fish can have up to 80 bones just in the skull. Wow. You got to glue all those back together. Every single bone. That is amazing. You're like a mad scientist, dude. Yep, I got patience for this and this only. <laughs> <laughs> and your kid. Yeah, for now. Because, because she is a daddy's girl. 
I've seen you with her. <laughs> that is amazing. Look, Z, that's, that's the deadly end right there. Mm -hmm. This is so, so cool. Man, that takes so much patience. Yeah, ain't kidding. Especially to reconstruct the skull. That's just... All right, Z, we're going to leave you here with him for a week. He's going to teach you how to do this stuff. Again. But he's going to start you in the bug room first. Again. Not without these, you're not. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Z almost threw up going in there. Again, I just ate. <laughs> He's like, I don't want to waste my chicken sandwich. You know Next time, we'll bring the food here and you can eat in there. No. Yeah, well... That way you get used to it. Yeah. Because they're going to steal my food if I eat it. <laughs> <laughs> not, not at the rate of speed you eat, pal. No kidding. <laughs> then I would eat them. <laughs> and that's a waste of money. Oh, my goodness. This is incredible stuff, dude. Incredible. incredible incredible stuff now what's the next show you get ready for um i've got a comic con next weekend and then everything after that gets focused on denver gym and mineral show holy smokes just show after show after show yes sir you guys load up the big van and head out set up sell tear down and do it all again Yep, yep, prep, 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 sell, sell, sell. That's amazing stuff, bro. Amazing. And you do such an incredible job with these. That is great. Wow. All right. Let's go back around with some stuff. Let's have right. some fun. All right, that was super cool. Um, Josh, this is some amazing work, huh, guys? Oh, yeah, definitely. See, let me see some of those stuff he got us. Hey, here's the small box. That's just a small box of the, uh, some little, little pieces of, uh, amethyst. Just what you want. Yeah. Check out these amethyst. Uh, these aren't amethyst geodes, these are geodes that are dyed geodes. And they're so, so cool. Look at that one. He got us a bunch of these. And we got reds, we got purples, and I don't know what other colors. And then the agate slices, Z. Got us. There, and this one. Okay. In this big box, you take that box off and then underneath, rip it underneath. There's some cool stuff he got us for our auctions, which you guys are going to be able to get it a great deal. Anywhere, Z, or no? I did this I'm probably in there. We gotta 
empty them all into the yeah. box. Then you got uh, some skulls. You can check that top, that top yeah. box out. So. And right there on the bottom. There's one. There's the one. Oh, there's the. He got us uh, a whole box of little skulls. These are awesome. Different agates. There's the other one. Oh, uh, and the bigger ones. Those are super cool. What is that one? What kind of agate is that? See, that's that uh, mossy oak, right? Uh, mo just mossy. Mossy agate. Yeah, moss agate. Mossy agate. Oh, that that's cool. That one's really I gotta take my glasses off to actually see the color. Yeah, it's beautiful. I like all the way the markings go through it. Yep. Yeah, Josh got us a bunch of cool. That is a cool piece. Cool stones. Don't let John see these, he'll be like the seagulls. Mm -hmm. See so yeah, mine, 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 mine. That's the big one. There's yeah. another one. Yeah, we I, showed, I showed the small ones. Oh, here's a purple one. That's blue. That's, is that blue? Lapis. That's lapis. Okay. That's a cool little blue lapis one. You guys can see it. That's a cool one. But now, we're all the way up here in Daytona, so we thought we'd show you guys something cool if it's possible. I don't know. Josh said, I don't know how crowded it's going to be, but we're going to attempt to show you guys what a Bucky's is. I don't even know what Bucky's is. Z's never seen a Bucky's. Bucky's is the largest truck stops in North America. They literally have 125 gas pumps. Which is insane. And then the inside Z mm -hmm. is like a super Walmart. But bigger. Yeah. Is it a bunch of random stuff as usual? Really it's all, all kinds of stuff. You can get anything there. Their food is unbelievable. Whoa, buddy. Hey. hey. There's no sharing the lane. Hey there, pal. This is your exit coming up. Yeah. I, I see why. Why, why is he? Uh, the dad was holding on to the side right there. It was his kid driving. Oh, oh really? really? Yeah. Oh. Well, that's he not was very doing nothing. Uh, <laughs> so this is the Bucky's exit. I don't know if we'll be able to go in, Z, but we'll, we'll try. Yes. And this way... We might be able to show you guys what a Bucky's is. For anybody that's never seen one. I haven't seen one in so long, it's not even funny. Same. And last Vegas. Texas was the last one yep. I went to, and that was... I when I used to I, live there many uh, moons ago. I don't even think I've been to that one in Texas. No, you weren't at that one in Texas. No, that's when I got sick after you got... You just got better, and I was just started to get sick. No, that uh, we didn't see one that trip. Okay. That's what I see in front of us. Uh, there it is. But I yeah, don't you can know. go in the right lane. This left lane. This way. This lane turns that way too, because we got to go left afterwards. Oh my God! Look at this, guys. Look how big that place is. Holy smokes! It's like bigger than a super Walmart. Look at that. I think it's bigger than the Sam's Club across the street. It is. That it's bigger than the Sam's I'm looking Club. Looking at that, and there's the Sam's Club. That Sam's, yeah, yeah it's definitely bigger. Yeah. Yeah, it's bigger than the Sam's Club. Hold on, we'll show you guys. Let's stop this. This why, is unbelievable. Why, why, why is it bigger? I don't know, Z. Well, it's, what purpose? You ain't never heard the saying? Bigger's better? But why for you guys? <laughs> okay, all the record drivers go there. So it must be good. Uh, two of them are. Oh my goodness. This is unbelievable. Yeah. This is just insane. The 
parking lots to act like you're going to the mall. To be fair, this with the size of it, it basically is a mall. Dude, it, it's huge. Look at that right in front of us, guys. Holy smokes. It's Bucky's. This is a truck stop. This is crazy. They have 125 fuel pumps. No semis this way. Huh. That's because I got to go around the long way. I, I don't know. Come on, dude. Move. There's plenty of parking. Come on. You know what? I just, where is he? Right there. I was going to go right up in here. Up in here. You got one on your right, one on your left. Just pick one. Okay, that's somebody that has a bucky's. You going to back into that one? Yep. Someone got a bucky's uh, tire cover. No way. Yeah. And I hit a pump version of it. We can get a bucky's tire cover? I see it. <laughs> I don't know, it looks custom made. No, they probably sell them here. What do we need a tire cover for? We don't have a tire, our tire's underneath. Are yeah. we driving a Jeep? Do, do we have a tire in the back? It's only Jeeps that do that. No, there's no, a few other some, cars. Some pickups have it. Okay. Hi, let's go inside and show you.